In this video, we're going to show you an example of how to measure with the Kano Point 10 smart sensor. The demonstration will make use of the smart sensor simulator. The Kano Point 10 smart sensor is the first of a new family of Optimet's non-contact laser displacement sensors. The new smart technology contains a rich set of algorithms which makes integration easy and provides pass-fail results rather than a simple displacement value. The Kano Point 10 smart sensor provides 10,000 points per second, keeping all Optimet advantages. This new sensor family allows fast 2D profile measurement, analysis, and feature evaluation. The built-in smart technology uses a web-based interface, so there's no need to install anything on the host system. First, go to Job Definition to start a session, and then press Play. When the sensor is connected, its icon on the upper right side of the screen will turn green. After a few seconds, the measurement points are collected and you'll get a profile. Then you can use two possible filters by pressing SNR, signal to noise ratio, and total, which indicates the intensity of the signal. Now press features to start selecting the feature you want to measure on the profile. Go to the right side of the screen to open the Features Library. A library containing tens of different features will open. These include angle, distance, radius, height, and many more options. In this example, we'll choose the Radius feature. Click on the circle whose radius you wish to measure, define the pass-fail value and tolerance, and click Add. You'll get an immediate parameter measurement which will display in red if it fails to meet the defined tolerance, or green if it passes. In order to save the current job, press the Save icon, enter a file name, and press Save again. Now you can go to Live Session and open the Jobs Files Library. You may choose the one you want in order to implement it live and receive an immediate Go-No-Go no -go result for your tested object. After a few seconds, you'll see the outcome as the number of passes or fails on your object profile. The software will indicate this for each separate feature, and in this particular example, we see it shown for radius only. You may define as many features as you wish for each profile. For further information about the smart sensor, please contact us.